a matter of being reminded that our knowledge has limits. There'll be bumps in the road and we'll learn from our mistakes. Alone we can do so little, together we can do so much. It's really all about the people that we care for. So ultimately, it's the patients that come into our care every single solitary day, and that is our mission, free from infection. We, us, are at the crossroads of so many things, things that you don't really think you're signing up for when you come into the field. Um, and whatever it is, it lands on our doorstep again and again. Always, always a thrill to be at annual conference, the largest gathering of infection preventionists in the world. IPs really do rock, you, you are amazing. I did not expect to see so many people and I was sitting behind folks from various international locations so that was actually really um, interesting as well. We have to stay ready and think outside of the box, be creative. We don't know it all in one institution. We just need to network and gain knowledge from each other. It's good to know that we aren't the only ones out there. We. We keep trudging along and we keep fighting the fight. It's my first time and it's just, it's been so enlightening to be with people who understand my pain. <laughs> What's important isn't the number of papers, it's the number of grants. It's about kindness, compassion, connectedness, and it's about the type of love that I believe this organization emanates. And I can feel it in the room. If you have love, you can then work backward to monitor and improve the system. So my profound simplicity to improving quality, enhancing safety and preventing infections is love. <laughs>